Hello everyone and welcome back to some prison architect. When we last left off we just completed the shakedown and did not Or for some reason no one's deployed or anything. Looks like our dog got pulled off dog. But arm guards get pulled off. Yeah, that's really weird. It pulls like a lot of stuff off the tools, but oh, not that glitch again. But busy rest. Okay. Resting over here. Let's see how it works. But anyway, I don't know if I explained this in the last episode, but armed guards, how they work is they suppress any prisoners in their area of effect because they're kind of badasses like that. So, um, you can have them in their area of effect prisoners in dangerous areas or with max security prisoners and they'll be um, suppressed, but suppression has negative effects as we've seen on things such as studies, prisoner mood, um, stuff like that. So we really don't want to too badly inhibit those things. So I usually just use armed guards for just guarding purposes. So we're going to slightly suppress prisoners who come take stuff to exports etc but for the most part we should be pretty good. So, um, we're gonna get a start on our new cell block here. So what we'll do is, I'll we'll do a couple things here. Firstly, um, where's our materials? Not be tile. Tile there. I guess we can do it even past there. But then we also demolish walls here and put in a large geodor. We then fence. We'll go ahead and jump across. So, too many. There. So we're golden. So those guys will get to work. Okay, we're gonna want to be careful here. Um, actually, gonna Oops. just in case any prisoners get any smart ideas. Well, this is still under construction. Hmm. So let's quickly, oops, let's quickly check our queue here. Just kind of curious, what is everybody doing? Dump, oh, okay, a lot of them are dumping food waste. And there's also some constructing fences. So we are got some good stuff happening here. Yeah? Got some cheese slices on the mouth. Found some more drugs. Fine. 
and we'll have cell block C soon enough. So since now we have the thing, we can now put our um, on guard. Take them off here and put them back on the control over here. This can now be locked open. And what we're going to do is So I want both. Well, I probably need like a one space between the wall and here. Here. So and then this is eleven or sixty-one. Wait. Craft. Eleven by sixty one. Put it there. Put a couple large jail doors in and we're golden. You guys will be surprised at the how much cash flow this takes though. It is pretty expensive. And since we have 40 um, prisoners now, we can actually increase our um, deployments for jobs. I say, but yeah, that's fine. Um, we could probably actually get more people. Yeah. This only says four. We'll hold off for just a little bit. Yeah. Still a bunch of people in foundation education. 14 finish them pass, but 50 percent pass rate. But again, that should be increasing shortly here. Remember, always cancel all your lights. Then you can walk our doors open. And as we have, we know how this works. Okay. Okay, so this goes. Two on each side. That's actually not exactly what I want, did you? Because I might as well go with. So this one will be more like plan orientated. Second, and then more we'll accept prisoners here in a second. So, start cloning. Nope. Just screwed that up, so we'll probably can just go cancel it all. Only thing we'll have to redo is this one here. Yeah. Oop, anyway. So, about that, guys. So, clone. I think we only need this. That. 
I wasn't gonna go with that again, but it'll be fine. I really like this because the fire is actually easier to line up. Cell costs. Go oh, another solitary in there. Got to pay for all the bricks and a lot of stuff to pay for. But um, we can start accepting more prisoners. I just like having no more prisoners. But I guess we could go to one block of each too if we wanted. But I don't have the proper stuff to segregate them like I'd like to. Well, I'd, if I was going to accept all three prisoner types, I'd try to segregate them. Like, I can put one in each, I can build three blocks, but then they're going to eat together and stuff. But, I don't know. I just like have the normal prisoners. Oh. So this is the... AA meeting. So we can see his understanding is excellent, his concentration is adequate, his attendance is 54%. Yeah, so they have adequate pass chance. Mr. Delay. Oh, I guess he hasn't been in the program for very long. But his concentration is really bad as well. Delay, why is your concentration so bad? Um. Why? But I mean, all we know is John Jones is good enough pass, and he's not going to be an alcoholic anymore. Yeah, it's good chance. The only thing about the gardener is the gardener is always busy because there's so much stuff for him to do. Because I only have one gardener, which is good. You'd gardener may as well be busy doing stuff. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Yeah, even dog handlers get tasers as well. So, well, what you got on? Nope, didn't find anything. Can't we complete? Oh, we made it so that it's. Oh no. Oh, we got 50 prisoners in our prison now. Space for 50 prisoners. Got that one. 100. So 
So we're going to take utilities from... Yeah, we're going to take utilities from this power station and swing them across. But water has to be pulled from the same utilities line. Um, I'm going to drag across because what happens is prisoners can tunnel in the pipes. So you generally want to keep your pipes as far away from your walls of your prison as possible. So we'll just bring this one right across. And it's pretty central in the prison, so probably a pretty good one. I'll go straight up like that. here so Uh, we will stop for the moment. We're about 17 minutes in, so thank you very much for coming out, and I will see you next time.